What's up everybody? Welcome back. Hello for the first time. And I hope you're enjoying your day. Because it is perfect out here. It is like 75 and I tell you what, summer is just starting here in Chicago in June. Couldn't ask for any better weather. I honestly hate when it's a little too hot, but we're gonna be going and trying to get some photos of the 690 today. I know a few spots in uh, Geneva that we're gonna be checking out and uh, see what we can get. Oh, shit. Sorry, didn't get over. It's a divided highway, we're fine. Ah, I hate riding with backpacks. Backpacks just suck. You know, it makes me tempted to do one of those little carrying things in the back like the ADP bikes do. No, it's just so ugly. No need for that. Hello, hi. Ooh, another fun update. So we're going to Spring Creek Nationals for the Lucas Oil Pro Motocross Series race, race number seven next week in Milford, Minnesota. I'm gonna be putting together a series of videos to what that. I'm gonna be putting together a series of videos of that trip because it'll be kind of cool. I'll, I'll go up there for work. We'll get to go to the races. It'll be fun. Thank you, honey, for buying me the tickets. I'm excited because I've never been to an outdoor race before. I've been to Supercross where you sit in a stadium and you do that. I've been to what? Uh, Indy, Atlanta, uh, Detroit. And, uh, and those are fun and fine and dandy, but I don't know. There's something about being outside, about uh, sitting on the grass and watching some of that walk around the pits instead of just going to pretty much a coliseum where you just sit there in a normal bleachers and watch it like any other sporting event. So that will be awesome. Now, I don't follow religiously the sport, but I mean, I've been watching it. I've been riding dirt bikes. I've been riding motorcycles my entire life. And I love that factor to it. I'd rather watch one of those races than the uh, MotoGP races, which are, are fun to watch. Don't get me wrong, some of those updates, but I don't know, it's just going to be cool and especially interesting if it's going to change or update in the next couple years because I think, again, with that new start card and the one that I got coming, I think that could change the sport dramatically. I think my prediction here, market for 2022, I bet 2024 we'll see what is with this. We'll see some of those start bars actually in a Pro Series MXGP or Monocross race. I bet you. I, mean, I think. I think the bikes can be that good. I mean, heck, we'll know 2023 in February when I finally get mine. If it stays at that date before it gets moved, but I think. I think so. Someone in the YouTube universe commenting on one of my videos that their 690 cooked itself at 1700. I guess uh, the issue was oil starvation, but uh, KTM didn't do anything about it because he had you know, Tecmo Head or Aero Exhaust, a few other mods that could have quote unquote conflicted with the factory warranty. So that's something I'm looking out for. Not too far away, only 400 miles from that 1700 mile mark. So 
I don't know. That's one thing that I've noticed and a lot of people have told me like, hello, okay, cool. Um, these bikes tend to eat oil. So I always make sure when the bike is warm, check the oil levels, do it, you know, both before and after a ride, make sure the color's good. Because apparently the LC4s tend to get hungry and eat a little bit. So I always want to make sure that I'm in tip top shape. Oh. oh, what is going on here? Oh yeah, I'm gonna be that guy. Sorry everyone. Yes, I know. What the hell are you doing? Welcome to Geneva. It's a cool little place. They got an island park over there. They got that little waterfally thing, and we're going to be going down this way to try to grab some photos. But maybe I should start riding through some of these little small towns here in Illinois and showing everybody what they're like. Easy now. Ooh. We going swimming? Oh, those brakes are squeaky. <laughs> Come on now. There we go. All right. Here we go. Now the fun part. Don't tip over. Alright, so this is my Sony A7C with the uh, Sigma 24-70 on it. Well, now nah, it should be good. But, uh, I mean, it's a nice camera. It's fun. It's fine. It works. But I tell you what, it kind of sucks with the viewfinder. Yeah, it's going to be really dark, isn't it? Maybe if I go to that angle. Oh, showing its weight. Better question. So I'm going to be able to get it out of here. And I'm still in shadows. Whatever. Oh, I'm already sweating. Holy smokes. All right. Hey, that's anything that's good over here. All right. So much easier when you got power. Alright. I have done like right over here too. This is kind of cool. Yeah, like that. Yeah, that'd be cool. Okay. Oh, but I gotta turn it around though. Let's get in the green first. Yeah, that'll be cool. I think I got some good ones to play with. Let's see if I can find anywhere else and how that looks. Oh, back to the freaking backpacks. Yeah, well, that was cool. I feel like I got some good shots. I guess we'll edit those up and see how they look. And hopefully I can build an intro out of it. Kind of a funky little spot, but I guess really. On to the next. Ooh, hoo -hoo. Easy now. What if there's any other cool spots? I gotta do my research a little bit more. Cause I know that Jeep dealer's been there since hell forever. What else would look cool? Dairy Queen? I don't know. 
don't know. <laughs> but at least it's a good day to get out and ride. Why is it wiggling? Oh, we got some big sweepers here. Thanks for tuning in and watching me shoot some photos. Who so, knows how they'll turn out, good or bad, but I'm excited to see Spring Creek bring you some of that inside information. That's going to be a little more vloggy than motorcycle oriented, but hey, hopefully it'll be a, uh, a good video for that, which hey, it's next week. I'm excited if this weather stays like this, oh, it's going to be a good weekend. But until next time, if you guys see anything, hear anything, want to know anything, let me know in the comments down below and I'll try my best to make a video answering those questions, showing you what I did, so on and so forth, and give you a little information. So as I hit traffic here, until next time, keep riding.